Привет, товарищи, and welcome to another episode of our glorious KGB Let's Play in Phantom Doctrine. We're moving forward relatively quickly. I think we're in episode 12 right now, and I feel like we've made a decent bit of progress. And this session, we're going to dive into well, two things. One is this special mission in Moscow, and two is this beholder cell in Dublin that we will send out some uh, agents to scout nice and early because they're affecting our income right now. And I want to see if I can't capture some agents to use our uh, MK. MK Ultra facilities on and on the topic of the MK Ultra facilities let's actually go into the workshop to kick things off and research the where is it brainwashing technology here from the MK Ultra facility it'll cost us 1500 it'll take nine hours not too long not too bad at all and uh, I just I want to start experimenting and exploring some of the options in there so uh, yeah brainwashing tech let's develop that upgrade we have a fair bit of cash still. Danger is slowly creeping up, but we're still all right. There's still a ways to go before it's actually dangerous. I'm feeling okay about that. I'm feeling okay about that. Now, we still have Indigo in the hospital, as well as Referee, but, you know, he's he's fine. Uh, Indigo will take some time before she leaves the hospital, unfortunately. Uh, nine hours to go, but I don't think I'm going to wait for that. What I'm going to do is roll right into the activities today. We're going to see what's going on in Novosibirsk, we're going to see what's going on in Kabul, we're going to do the special mission, and we're going to dive into the Beholder cell over here. Now, there's a chance that some of the suspicious activity will turn out to be a mission as well, and if it is, then we'll tackle that if it's going to bump up our danger by too much. So, before I dive into that, just a quick mention, guys, uh, if you've been enjoying this series, the best thing to do is to let me know by dropping a comment and a like on this video. I look at those numbers a lot. I mention this basically every episode, but I look at those numbers to let me know that people are interested and that I should keep a series alive and running at the same pace. So if you guys have been enjoying it, just let me know down below and uh, feel free to you know share as well. And if you aren't already in our Discord, uh, then I highly recommend joining our Discord as well. The link to that is in the description below as well. A great little community we've got going of you know 900 or so people. I call it little, uh, but it's great. It's always nice to hang out there. Anyway. Enough, enough sort of time wasted with that introduction here. Let's dive right in. I think the first thing I'm gonna do is actually send some people over to Dublin for some tactical recon. Theremin is particularly good at it, so Theremin, and let's get Kodiak going in there as well. All right, let's begin that job. And uh, they're going all the way from Vladivostok, so that's fine, all right, that's fine. And we're also going to get, uh, who do we get to Novosibirsk here? We'll get Ducknose and Needles down here. And we'll get Falcon and Ranchero down to Kabul. And I wonder if... I think I have to send, oh, two agents. Okay, fine, fine. Fine, so maybe we do this after some of these investigations of the uh, suspicious activities that are going on. And again, so nine hours until brainwashing tech is completed. Um, okay. Yeah, let's move on. Let's move on. I wonder if I want to keep brainwashing tech... Or if I want to wait until brainwashing tech is done before I dive into the uh, the mission over here, just to make sure I actually get an agent. If I if I manage to capture an agent, I want to get it uh, or get him or her back to my base to, you know, poke and prod and learn some information. Maybe brainwash. All right, duck nose and needles, you're over to here now. Let's begin. Six hours to get there. I just want to make sure there's nothing happening here that's about to cause me trouble. All right, back to the facility here. And what do we work on next? I think... Oh, this isn't a bad idea. Very expensive, but it might be worth it. Five hours. I don't want to lose perks when brainwashing. I'm also wondering if we should take a look at uh, something like... Where are we? Um, agents can accumulate more heat before they are compromised. Like, that's not a bad idea. Six hours, 800, it's pretty cheap. That's not a bad idea at all, actually. Maybe I should do that. Yeah, let's do that before anything else. And then we'll let the money accumulate a little bit. It's always good to have some money to spend. All right, we're good down here. I think we can send... Who's over here again? It's Falcon and Ranchero. Can we send you up to the special mission? A vulnerable KGB officer has access to the archives. Convince him to part with Kingfish's files. All right, so Falcon, Ranchero, and you know what? Let's get number 15 there as well. Oh, it's only two tops. Fair enough. Fair enough. Let's, uh... These guys are kitted out because of the last mission, so we should be good to roll. And something I'd actually like to do on that note is... Uh, where are we? Theremin. He's carrying the VZ-61 and the GAL. Now, I want to replace the VZ-61 with the TKB because he's proficient with this as well and uh, it causes a fair bit more damage across the board the reload cost is a little bit higher 
Um, but the amount of damage output is significantly better. It is better than the Gal as well, but uh, I want to keep two weapons on anybody, really, so that we can um, alternate if we run out of ammunition. The other thing is that uh, Theremin typically goes in in disguise, again, because of the actor trait, so I'm not even going to bother giving him equipment here. Uh, that's I think that's fine. Everybody else is set up. Otherwise, Ranchero has got his gear set up. I don't think I need to swap anything else out over here. Uh, we've got uh, Falcon, again, with the suppressor and the uh, LMG-26 the lock picks as well on her. Yeah, I think everybody else is kitted out as I need them or want them to be, I should say. Um, I should start selling some of this equipment. Like, I've got a lot of these MU-255s and I'm barely using them. I can sell them for a fair chunk of cash, actually. Like, there's a lot of money just sitting in my, uh, in my warehouse here. Let's keep that in mind when I make investments. Nonetheless, let's push forward. Let's see what's going on. Any more suspicious activities? Doesn't seem to be the case. Oh, 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 oh. Oof. Almost missed my opportunity to recon here. Unfortunately, we can't tail. I need to I need to um, research something in the workshop before I can do that. Maybe I should work on that. But let's get some tactical recon going on over here. Duck nose and needles, the both of you begin this job. Or... Hmm. It'll take Theremin too long to ping back and forth. So it'll have to be... It'll have to be duck nose and needles since you're already here. Let's begin the job. And, uh, yeah, let's see when what we get. For me, you haven't come across my buddy wizard, have you? The sea is full of fish, Omicron. Oh, fuck you, mate. You could really use his help. Okay. Uh, all right, we've got the watermarking tools. Let's go back to the facility. Again, we've got a fair chunk of cash, thanks to all the sales we just made. So maybe we consider... Maybe we consider... Agents lose heat faster. Solid shovels is just a funny bit of research there unlocks the tail job allowing to reveal enemy cells maybe we go with that 11 hours might as well do it we literally just spoke about the fact that i should probably do it so we'll do that first accumulate some more money and then maybe we take a look at the uh safer brainwashing chems afterwards we should have enough uh funds Ooh, intel on mi6 safe house omicron delivered a top secret mi6 file detailing the location of several safe houses there is one particular safe house that seems like the best candidate, but the file will require some additional investigation to confirm the exact location of the site. Time is running out. We better get to work. Okay. All right. Well, I say we dive into this then. If time is running out, how much intel do we have? All right. Increment number 13, top secret, emergency operations protocol. First of all, I certainly need not remind you that you are not officially part of the SIS and you have no affiliation with Her Majesty's government. Should you be compromised, you will be completely disavowed and the government will deny any knowledge of your actions. However, SIS maintains a number of unlisted safe houses that you can use in dire situations. Take special care not to reveal the location of these safe houses to third parties, including allied intelligence services. Ooh, <laughs> such a... Mm, what a line. Don't even tell our friends, of course. Cornerstone, located on the outskirts of Redacted, exact address in the appendix. This warehouse has been adapted in collaboration with Royal Post. Facilities include storage and lodgings for a team of up to eight operatives with provisions for two weeks. Stocks of weapons are limited to small arms due to the vicinity of industry posing incendiary and explosion risk. The safe house is located mere 20 miles from the local naval base, which makes it a good staging point for operations involving infiltration from submarines. Ooh, fancy, fancy. All right, local naval base, that's a place. Or is it the Royal Post? No, that's a thing. That's an organization. Cornerstone? Hmm, there we go. What else have we got? Three pieces of intel. That is not enough. Ooh, Vlad the Impaler. That's the second place this has come up. Boreas and, and Broadsword as well. All right, from Rockstar. That's suspicious. Redacted. I will be thoroughly unreachable for the next two days in placer claim. In the interests of enjoying this brief holiday to the fullest, I am establishing the following contact protocols. Cardinal, contact me only if our friend Redacted surfaces, utterly penitent and holding an extensive dossier on the crimes committed by Redacted. And then a lot more Redacted information. Very interesting. Very interesting. And what's here? Satellite imagery classified cargo from Redacted shot by Andromeda. Previous sightings of the same merchandise were reported both by Rockstar in Redacted and Redacted in Redacted. If the contents of the cargo are what Sapper suspect, it means Redacted is correct that MK Ultra is still active in some form or another. Hush hush. Now now. 
don't worry about that. Consult with Sapricor on further action to be taken. Redacted official recommendation is to continue surveillance and see what crops up. Okay, so we have Rockstar and Rockstar. And that's it. That is nowhere near enough. All right, back to the map. Let's push forward. Special mission about to be engaged here. Oh, a lot more sneaky stuff going on. All right, let's see. Who can we send up to Murmansk? I don't want anybody to get... Uh, I don't want anybody to get ambushed, but let's try it here. Let's take a risk. What is life without risks after all? Let's see what's going down up there. We're going to get a secret soon as well. Ooh, enemy recon, 20 hours. Not enough agents to do tactical recon. It'll increase danger by 13. And it'll take... No... 16 hours, 10 hours to do recon. I wonder if we'll be able to move in after we're done in Moscow. Maybe. Maybe. And let's send uh, let's send number 15 over to Vienna here. Well, I thought that was suspicious activity. Oh, there is. Okay. Let's go. All right. Keep an eye out for that special mission to be completed. HMS Conqueror has arrived. HMS Conqueror will have arrived home by now. The recovered enemy cargo will now be moved to a secret location, awaiting further processing. The enemy will attempt to recover the cargo as soon as possible. We must beat them to it, or we'll lose all trace of this conspiracy. Cannot allow that to happen. Come on, Tavrishi, let's work faster here. Information from our informant in Leningrad. Warren has been revealed. An enemy. An enemy. In Murmansk. Okay, he's the guy who's doing that recon right now. That's fine. That's fine. Hopefully we'll be able to cut him off. Any second now. Come on, come on, come on. All right, so bribe KGB. A little palm grease can go a long way. We have obtained Kingfish's files from KGB archives. Excellent. Let's pause it. We'll look at that in a bit. First, I want to send Falcon and Ranchero up here to recon. And now we can take a look at that uh, at that dossier. What's going on at the workshop? One hour left. Okay. Uh, analytics, investigation board. Let's take a look at... Wow, we have a lot of dossier going on right now. Oh, we haven't got any intel on Kingfish's dossier just yet. So we'll leave that be for the time being. And let's resume here. Tactical recon in Kiev. Hmm. Don't have much time. If it was to go in for the assault, we'd only go in with two. It's not so ideal. Let's give it some time. Four hours. Three hours left. We should... Well, this is going to be an actual recon. One hour till that's done. Okay, so we have time. Unlocks the tail job. Alright, cool. Let's go back to the facility here. And shall we get the uh, safer brainwashing chems? I think that's not a bad idea. I think that's not a bad idea. So brainwashing does what? Erase agents past influence and secret allegiances, but risk losing their talents, right? Okay, just making sure I had that right. So in that case, yes, let us get safer brainwashing chems. Should we need to use it sooner rather than later? Back to the world map over here, and let us wait that one hour out. So nervous. Why am I so nervous? It'll give me a pop-up. Like, I know it'll give me a pop-up, but I'm still nervous. All right, so Theremin and Kodiak have now been freed up, so let's pause that. Uh, we're going to go in with this first. Yeah, we'll deal with this first, this Kiev mission first, and then we'll deal with the Beholder Cell in Dublin. Then we'll take a look at what's going on in Murmansk, and we can actually send number 15 over to Brussels to investigate this situation. First things first, though, Kiev. In for the assault. Let's get Theremin. I mean, I could just do this with Theremin, to be perfectly honest. It'd be pretty cool. Uh, maybe we replace Kodiak, actually, with... Mm, Ducknose, perhaps? Hmm. Wouldn't mind having the LMG-26 out there. All right, and we can get the first aid kit and a frag grenade in case things go sideways. I do like having smokes on me, but uh, might not be an option this time. Indigo's definitely not going. Needles... No, no, no. I'd, I'd rather go in with that uh, suppressed B-76. So sure, let's assign Duck Nose Theremin. Use a disguise, please. Good sir. What do you got? 
Mm. There we go. That's a better look. Let's go with that one. Hopefully Duck Nose doesn't have to get involved. And we do have Referee, our spotter, as always. And let's get um, number 15. Let's assign you for that smoke screen. Should be a somewhat easy mission, I hope. I mean, I wonder if I should send uh, someone who speaks Russian instead, actually. If I don't send Duck Nose, who could I send here? Falcon doesn't speak Russian, do you? No. I want somebody who still has access to a suppressed weapon, but also speaks Russian. I wish you could organize by a language or something. Theremin's already on this mission. I don't want to send myself because I don't have a suppressed weapon. Fine, we'll, we'll take the risk. Uh, duck nose. You're good. All right, we've got distract available on Theremin. We've got this. We've got a frag grenade. We've got first aid kit. We should be good to roll. Let us begin. Yeah, let's do this. All right. Always get nervous. Magic Isle over at Kiev. An enemy operative is conducting reconnaissance. Reconnaissance. I always get that word wrong. In this area, trying to locate our headquarters. Allowing them to continue would put our operations in jeopardy. Make sure the agent never reports back. If possible, capture the trespasser for interrogation. So primary objective, killer capture, and then evacuate upon completion. I'm hoping to capture. Hoping to capture. All right, let's see. What's the deal here? We got two... Camera terminals, one here, one up here. We have one entry point over here. We've got one entry point over there. We've got the enemy target over here. Right. Well, I say, I think, we go in from over here, allowing us to enter, deal with the camera terminal, pick up this loot, and then we have to go upstairs somewhere. Where do we go upstairs? Where do we go upstairs? Here we go. So stairs up there. That'll bring us up over in this area. We'll go out the door here. Turn off this camera. Oh, that's not camera. That's uh, for trip wires and stuff. Okay. Okay, okay. As long as we play it safe, we'll be okay. So let's go in from here. I think that's the best call here. Hopefully Theremin gets deployed somewhere inside. And uh, otherwise we can just stay outside. No need to get too involved if we don't have to. Oh, there's some more loot down here. Definitely want to move down to that sooner rather than later. Pick it all up if possible. Alright, so yep, over here we'll deploy and potentially evacing over here as well. Let's see, where do we want our spotter? Oh, that's interesting. Leaving this terminal out in the open. Leaving this out in the open as well. Alright, alright, fair enough. If we get our spotter on the south side, we'll be able to look right into here. We'll be able to look into here, here. All right. That might be the way to go, rather than going on this side. Hmm. Then there's a the north side, which some of our vision will be blocked, but we could look all the way down to here. Up and down this hallway. Now, I think south side is the way to go. So, south support. Let's get the tactical spotter. And then if we are planning, in fact, to evac over here, what I could do is get uh, West Support be our smokescreen. Because that can go all the way down this path. doesn't seem to be obstructed. We can cover those windows up. We can also fire up top over here, I hope, cover up some of these windows. So, yeah, so West Side Support is going to be the smokescreen. Hopefully, I'm not cacking this up. Let us deploy right over here and begin. All right. We've got this, we've got this. Again, I must not let myself get too confident after that uh, previous session. That went well, but... But, you can only go downhill from there. One enemy operative. Eliminate or capture. Keep it quiet, if possible. That's over she. We'll keep it quiet, we'll keep it quiet. Now, I want to send Duck Nose down here towards this loot right from the get-go. No reason not to. Let's make sure we don't get spotted and identified or recognized or anything silly like that. Let's move up to here first. Yeah. There, I see. I gotta play it slow. Gotta Slow and steady wins the race. It's not an agent, so they won't recognize us, but we also don't need to knock him out. We're good. We're good. Move on over to here. Don't mind me. Excellent. And Theremin, you're in where? You're in there. Alright, so we can get close to the terminal this turn. Uh, or we can go upstairs. No. no. So let's go close to the terminal this turn. Might as well see what's going on in here. And again, he's in disguise. He's an actor, so he should be relatively safe. 
Got two things to pick up over here. Hit that end turn button. Again, I want to try and capture the enemy operative. My skills are at your I would much prefer that to, um... Well, I don't want to go home empty-handed. Let's put it that way, right? Let's go and get this camera dealt with. Come on, come on. The time they take and the camera pan just adds to my, like, stress levels. I think we can pick this loot up as well, same turn. No one's going to be able to see us. No one's looking over here. So, uh, yeah, let's... Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on now. Okay, we got ourselves a cobra. Alright, alright. Always wanted a pet cobra. Just stroll past this fella here. He's not an agent or anything. Or do we wait? Because I'm not in a rush. And I can just wait over here and no one will be any wiser. Let's do that. Let's go slowly, right? Let's, uh... Yeah, let's just creep on up to here. Play it super slow. Good stuff. There we go. No one's hurt yet. No one's being shot yet. Got a snake in my pants with theremin. It's always uh, good to have. Like, you know, if you get ambushed, you just throw your snake at somebody. Alright, um... Yeah, let's just make our way towards this. It is a restricted area, but I can pop in through this door. Uh, let's stay tucked in against this wall here, though. I could open this door just to see what's going on, and hopefully there's nobody in here. Yeah, alright, we're good, we're good. Let's close that door in case somebody ends up in here. And Theremin, you're up again. Alright, we've got our loot, we've got our uh, cameras turned off. We can push out through here, I think. Okay, let's do a quick look around. So, four pieces of loot, two pieces of classified documentation. Um... Where are our stairs? Here are our stairs. Uh, I didn't check for any loot or anything in here, but it looks like it's clear, right? We want to take the stairs up. We'll end up over here. We want to step out this way, turn off the trip wires, pick up the loot that I thought I saw over here. There we go. There's the loot. Yeah, so let's go upstairs. Let's make our way Standing upstairs. The Theremin. Over here, good sir. A good gentleman, or perhaps over here. Gets us closer. Let's go. In and out, in and out. Alright, cool. Yeah, we're clear. We are clear. It's funny, it's, uh... <laughs> going in with just two agents, I feel like this mission is supposedly going to be an easier one. But at the same time, going in with just two agents, if things go sideways, if I make the slightest mistake and we get spotted, the stakes are so much higher. Oh, okay. All right, let's see. So you're going to go around this way. We'll see what you do, but I might be able to go in and pick up the loot and leave next turn immediately. Go by completely unnoticed. So let's uh, close this door, please. Thank you very much. We'll open that before we dive in. And Theremin, you're up again. Uh, literally now going up the stairs. Not tripping any laser wires. Right? And there's nothing down here for us to pick up. We might want to come in through here afterwards, but not just yet. Let's go on up over here. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Nice and easy. No one's looking this way. We're all good. Hit that end turn. I'm trying to make these turns a little bit faster, but at the same time, I don't want to risk everything just for the sake of speed. I'm sure you guys appreciate that, especially with a game like this. Uh, you just have to be so much, so careful. Let's pop this door open. Damn it. Of course, we can't see her. Of course, we can't see her. All right, well, let's tuck on over to here. You want to be thorough, right? Okay. Ah. Would you look at that? All right. So you're looking that way, and you're moving over to there next turn, and you're looking this way, and you're moving over to here next turn. So, hypothetically, I should be able to stay hidden over here. Well, maybe we move on over to here Close this door. Let's just be careful here. Worst case scenario, I can always move back and forth a little bit. Not the end of the world. Theremin, you, my good friend, need to push out over here. We're just going to move first. And we'll interact with that later. Just want to make sure no one's able to see me over here. It would be smart to keep somebody out here patrolling this very crucial piece of equipment. But it seems we're dealing with some fools. Nobody shoot. So let's go. Bam, there we are. 
Excellent. Excellent. Hmm. Just a bunch of civilian movement, I assume. Alright, and then we've got our target over here. I don't know if we'll be able to take him down. Alright, let's pop this door open again. Activity and futility here. And we know someone's there. We don't know which way they're looking. This person is looking that way. So we're just going to step on over and get a peek. Oh, I can't see. Oh, man. That sucks. I guess I could push over to here. I should have pushed over to here instead. Well, lesson learned for, for next time. Oh, I still can't see in that corner. Damn. Don't want to take a useless risk. Close that door. Theremin, you're up. My confident friend, let's move you up to here. Make sure no one's watching us. Seems to be the case. No one is looking in our general direction. No one can see us from up over here or anything silly like that. All right, let us pick up the loot. Give me the loot. Okay, good stuff. One piece of intel. There's one more piece of intel and I think three more pieces of loot that need to be picked up. I read you. All right, let's try this door again. Okay, good stuff. Now we can see. So you're over there. You won't be able to see us. You're over there. You're not able to see us. And hopefully there's nobody else in that little corner. This will take one turn. I should be able to pull this off without any difficulty. Come on. There we go. We're okay. Super sneaky. Super sneaky. And then we can just step on out. And nobody is any wiser. Oh, done. Nice. Easy. Theremin, you're up. Let's get you rolling, buddy. Let's get you... There's no point coming down over here. Is there any... Am I missing out on anything over here? There might be some, like, loot or something, perhaps. We'll need to be thorough at some point. Might as well do it now. There doesn't seem to be any loot outside over here. It's funny. I never thought I'd have to check the outdoors for loot. But here we are. Don't see any intel or anything either. Nothing over here. Okay. Back up over here. Doesn't seem to be any intel or anything. There's got to be something in here. It's a locked room. Or perhaps it's one of the places where uh, the enemy agent might have spawned, I suppose. Oh, there we go. There's some more loot right down over here. So we do want to head back downstairs. And go through this hallway all the way to the end over here. Okay, fair enough. We want to do all that first because... Um, Because, just as a reminder, once I take... Oh my god, what are you doing, man? <laughs> That's very suspicious. Once I take the enemy agent out, I'm going to have to carry him out, and uh, then I won't necessarily want to backtrack and get Theremin back in here. All right, so let's get uh, Theremin. Put you down here, buddy, and through this hallway, I believe, over to here. Yeah, all right. All right, so let's get you over to these doors. Pop those doors open, see what's going on. And I just want to make a quick mention, uh, it was mentioned in the comments, I think, of the previous episode, that uh, something about my behavior is a little, maybe unrealistic, in how I... Uh, ooh, this is much easier, if I'm willing to take this risk. Uh, but yeah, it was mentioned that I'm a little unrealistic in how I separate my agents and don't really cover each other. And, uh, like I, and I do that to, to go chasing after loot. That's an interesting comment. Um, I don't know. I, I feel like uh, perhaps if I were an actual, you know, operative deployed on the scene, I would have faith in my, you know, fellow agents that they'll pull their bit off. And um, I would kind of rely on them to do their bit, and then I would do my bit. And if everything does go sideways, then I'd be quick to respond and, and, and assist them. But uh, I don't think that necessarily sticking together in terms of proximity is necessarily important or indicative of uh, of good teamwork. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. It's very possible. All right, where do you go next? Do you come down this way next? You're not going to recognize me, right? You're not an agent. You shouldn't recognize me. Maybe I pop in through here instead. Just to make me less nervous. It would make me less nervous. Oh, or I could pop in through here. Perhaps. Is there some intel here or anything? Doesn't seem to be the case, but we might as well investigate. 
just in case. Watch, I waltz right into an agent's face. Alright, we're good. We're okay. And this little gap here, I think, still lets me see this person. Alright, duck nose. You're not about to walk through here. There was an individual here who walked by. We're not gonna take any silly risks. Let's keep that door closed. And let's perhaps... I'm almost tempted to backtrack and pull duck nose back all the way. Let's pull you over to here. Just get ready for evac. Right? Huh? Alright, what do we got here? Buddy moves by. We're okay. Probably gonna come chasing in that direction afterwards. Next turn. Theremin. You're going to push on through... We might as well investigate this room as well. Just to make sure there is no loot or intel here. Yeah, it looks like we're good. So let's just push on through. Investigate this room as well. What could possibly go wrong? Alright, we're good. Famous last words. What could possibly go wrong? Well, there's a whole, like, other section back here. Maybe worth investigating with Duck Nose. I think we're able to get through to here without being spotted by anybody at all. Yeah, we're good. The next turn we push, we can't push through here, we'll push through here, pick up the loot, hopefully. Again, I want to investigate the area first before I just dive in and pick up the loot. <sighs> okay. <laughs> we're okay. I get My skills are at your disposal. so terrified. Alright, so let's just step out over here, nothing to worry about. Let's see where everyone's looking. I see this guy's looking up that way. This guy's looking at me, but he can't see me. Too far away. Right, right. No cameras or anything that I've left unattended, so I should be able to scoop this up without any issue. And hopefully that's the last of it. Ooh, serrated ammo. That's pretty interesting. So one more piece of loot and one more piece of intel. Where are you? Where are you? Up here, perhaps? I haven't been here. should certainly investigate this area. I'll need to get up here anyway. Maybe it's over here. Come on now. Glow for me. Watch, it's like glowing bright and I'm just missing it. Ah, there we go. Beautiful. Okay, so we do in fact need to go up over here. So we'll take Theremin up which way? I think down here there's... Nope, no staircase over here. Where are the stairs? Oh, okay, yeah, right over here. Cool. All right, so we're in the right spot here. We're in the right spot here. We'll move up these stairs. Hopefully that guy won't recognize us if we do. Go around, go all the way down, around this nonsense, and uh, spot that loot again. There it is. Okay, cool. I read you. Duck nose. Let's keep you close to evac. Let's take a quick look as to where evac is. Back over here is one of them, but we'll want to get one close to where the agent will be downed. So we can hop out the window, perhaps out this window over here, go through this door, out this window, and then out over here in this area. Um, so this is the ideal evac zone. Cool. Make sure Duck Noah stays in this area. We might want to take down some of these people before Theremin hops out, obviously. So let's keep Duck Nose over here. All right. Terrifying. Very unnerving. And they had to end up in my blind spot, of course. Of course. Hi. All right, well, we should be fine. We should be fine. Again, we're supposed to be here. If you act like you belong, people will think you do. And Theremin is an actor. Classically trained. Okay, so baddies over here. And our intel or our loot is over here. Cool. Right by the stairwell. I read you. Duck nose, we're gonna keep you here, I think. Again, we're gonna clear out the path there, and then when it's time for him to get out. This is going smoothly. This is going pretty smoothly. Hi. Theremin. In through here. Oh. Why can't we get in there? Oh, somebody must be waiting right over there. In which case, let's just step over here for the first bit of this movement. Open the door. Yeah, someone's blocking our path. Okay, well, hopefully they move soon. 
don't want to have to take them down pointlessly. That would be rather annoying. Let's stay put for this turn. And I'm hoping that the intel will be in there as well, because I can't see it elsewhere. So I'm hoping that uh, both items are in there and this guy leaves soon. I don't want to take him down if I don't have to. A good Soviet citizen doesn't require a concussion. Oh yeah, there we go. He moves next turn. So if he moves next turn, let's get ourselves... Ah, we might as well stay put. Well, I don't want to waste a turn, potentially. He's not an agent. He shouldn't recognize me. Okay, good. <laughs> Famous last words. In that case, let's just nudge a little bit closer. Go right up to here. And end that turn. We're still good over here. I should have checked, actually. Eh, buddy leaves. And I can just go pick up the loot and leave. Hopefully some intel as well. What do you require? Theremin, come on, buddy. Let's roll right in here. No one's going to notice. There's our loot. Ah, no, there's still some intel left. There's still some intel left. Where are you, intel? How did I miss you? How did I miss you? Is it in this room itself, perhaps? Nope, don't see it. In here. Don't see it. Up over here. Oh, well, don't tell me that I walked past it earlier. Nope, doesn't seem to be the case. I, I could try and use my, like, spotter here to see if he can't see it for me. We've got this hallway largely covered already. Um, I wish I could see in here. I mean, sure, my, my, might as well. Don't know what good that'll do me. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. Why you gotta play these games? I gotta play with my heart like this. Okay, how do I get to that without using I Duck Nose? Oh, there I'm in. God damn it. Alright, well, we gotta go back downstairs then. Cross to here. There's another staircase over here. So, at least it's not the worst thing in the world. All right, back down these stairs. Let's go. I wish I wish I could employ more than one disguise. It would make this go a lot quicker. That guy's looking at me very suspiciously. I don't like it. You want to die, buddy? This is this is how you die. We can roll on up. Gotta get to there, right? So roll on up to here. Stay tucked away. Hopefully, no one's here to spot me or recognize me. We're good. All right. Very nice. Very nice. Feeling like John Cena. No one can see me. All right, Theremin. Gonna pop you up this way, perhaps, and then we can go in through this little side door. Feel like that's the safest call. Horribly mistaken, but looks like we're good. Let's pop this door open. Yeah, there we go. We'll have vision. See that guy sneak by. Moving through here, pick up that intel. Alright, good stuff. We definitely have to go out the window. If we're gonna try and pick up this agent, we have to go out the window. Hoping that Theremin's health is enough. Because he doesn't have a suppressed pistol. Duck nose won't have vision. So, uh,. Here's hoping. Here is hoping. Alright, let's pick up this intel. No one's watching. Alright, excellent. Tactical espionage. Action. I got I myself an achievement. Now, what could I do? What could I do with Duck Nose to get me seeing in there? Is there? There's a ladder, I thought, somewhere nearby. Maybe I could use to get up there without needing to get into a restricted area. No, it doesn't seem to be the case. Damn. 
I'd love to get up here and if necessary go in with that B-76, get a single shot on the uh, the target just to get him down. That does not seem to be possible. We're just gonna have to hope. We're just gonna have to hope. Because otherwise... I'll, I'll, well, we'll cross that bridge when we get there, or potentially burn it when we get there, I suppose. Alright, so got that last piece of intel. Do we want to go up these stairs? Yeah, we might as well. Let's go. Alright, hit that in turn. Once we're up these stairs, we just gotta go in, knock that guy out. And I want to try, like, brainwashing or something. If he's worth brainwashing, I guess. Um, or I might just do it because I want to. Alright, so, there's a chance that this guy might recognize me. Which way do I want to go in? I can go in from this way, I can go from that way. There's no windows here. Maybe we uh, open this door first. See if there's anything in here. And just to double check, we have got everything. Let's open this door. So there's a civilian in here. Alright. And we don't know where that guy's looking. Yet. We'll find out soon enough. We'll find out soon enough. So, hit that end turn button. Yes good. Hopefully no one's going to notice when Theremin hops down with the uh, enemy agent. Alright. Theremin. Let's waltz you up to here. Open this door first. Okay. Oh, no way. Really? One hit point? One hit point. Okay. What can we do? What can we do? We can't do a takedown here. Hmm. I wonder if a distract will bring her out here and and maybe allow Ducknose to get a shot in that'll then allow Theremin to take her down. Like that's something I could try. Right? Otherwise I'm opening fire and uh and People are dying. Hmm. Distract an enemy or civilian. Like, what does that do? Does it just reduce their awareness? Does it actually move them? Haven't had a chance to try it yet. Damn, alright. Well, okay, Theremin. I'm gonna get you moving over this way. Let's see what we can do here. And Duck knows we'll pull back a little bit. So she's able to see up here. I really wish we could get up there somehow, but there's nowhere close enough. There's nowhere close enough. Yeah, all I, all I can really do is like pull Duck Nose back to here, maybe, or back to like here, I suppose. I hope that nobody spots her popping a shot. Guess I can pull her back to like here. Risky. God damn it, Thurman. Why couldn't you have, like, the survivor perk or something? Why? Why? Now I almost wish they were patrolling so that she might step out and get shot. Huh? Okay. Moment of truth. Let's see what distract does. We're gonna move over here. We're gonna open this door. Watch, it just draws aggro. We're gonna move... see you from here. Probably won't be able to see you from here either. Okay. Let's, um... This is goofy. Let's pop in over here. Okay. And let's use our distract ability on you. Let's see what this does. What does that mean? Oh, does it just turn them? Because that's useless. I guess it just turns them. God damn. What shall we do? I'm just trying to make sure that I have all my options covered here. Nothing I can do to buff my own health up. Like, my other option is to take a single shot 
pick her up and run, but then Duck Nose is in such a trouble spot. Like, I'm better off taking this guy down and waiting for the enemy agent to move around, but that'll move everybody around. Ugh. Well, first things first, let's call evac. Evac inbound. Alright, so three turns, they'll be here. Good stuff. I wonder if... Damn, what a... What an unfortunate situation for me to be in. Really no way for me to get in there. Or get up there. I can get up... Hmm. What about back here? I think I'm blocked off from back here. There's a ladder over here. I guess I could get up to here, but I have to go through the front. Are we about to do that? Are we about to pull Theremin all the way back just to help Duck Nose get up here so she can shoot? So then we can go in through here and up here. You know, it's not the worst. It's not the worst. close that door. Duck nose. Get you up to over here. The risks I take. I hope it'll be worth it. I hope it'll be worth it and we don't just get a grenade to destroy both of our agents here. We've got the evac vehicle coming. We're still in infiltration mode so it's not going to get compromised or anything like that. So that's good. Alright, Duck Nose, can we get you inside this turn? We can't. That's fine. But I'd rather get you up to here and opening the door. Like so. Right? And ideally, it's a straight shot to the stairs. In fact, I think it is. Let's get Theremin over to here. Hope we're able to see into this room, alright. think so. This guy's moving down there. Civilians moving up. I think we're good. Theremin. Uh, let's just make sure. Let's just take a peek through the windows over here. Right, there's nobody here. So we're in the clear. I'd like to close this door though. Because these guys are patrolling up and down here if I recall correctly. So, let's uh, close this door. No, 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 no. That's not what I meant. <laughs> close that door. Close this door. There we go. Duck nose. Let's uh, close this door, and then we'll walk through as well. This guy's looking that way. No one's looking at me over there. Let's uh, get you as far in as possible. I can't believe I'm doing this just so I can capture an enemy agent. I can't believe I'm doing this. Okay, in comes our evac vehicle. I wish they had different cutscenes for when things aren't so hectic. Like, I don't know, is this how people drive in Kiev? I don't think so. Not on a regular basis. Maybe they are. Let me know in the comments down below if you know better, but uh, it just seems a little funny to me to see that kind of driving, that kind of erratic driving when uh, everything's fine. Nothing's wrong. There's no reason to rush. Why draw suspicions? Right? All right. I read you. Okay, duck nose, we're gonna pull you up to over here. I should have called evac down here instead. Life of regrets. Well, actually, we don't know what kind of security is out over here, so maybe better off not doing that. Let's uh, get up to here. Okay. The question is, with a suppressed weapon being fired, hopefully, no, like, will the agent freak out? I will find out. We'll find out. I'm not 100% certain exactly how this is about to go down. Let's move Theremin up to there. Alright, so he'll, he'll be able to move in and take her down. 
Let's actually get him... Well, let's keep him there. Duck nose. I'm gonna move you to here, get you that full cover. Right? Could breach. But we'd shoot. So no. Alright, B-76. Single shot. It will kick off the alarm. Other option is just to kill her. That's so very frustrating. So very frustrating. It's like, am I missing something? I guess we can stabilize her. We should be able to stabilize her. Not enough damage. It's going to have to be a headshot. Oh, and even that's not enough damage. Well... Well then. Well then. We'll do what we can. Here it goes. Really? Hi. At least we can take her down now. 95. Go in. Bam. Good stuff. Mission target incapacitated. Copy team. Let's um gotta make a mad dash to there. We should be able to do it. We should be fine to do it. I mean I'm not not surprised. Not surprised. That was quite unfortunate. Oh, you know what? I'm a fool. I'm an absolute fool. Ducknose could have gone in for the takedown. Oh, what a fool I am. We could have done this without compromising anybody. Standing by for orders. All right, we're okay. We're okay. It's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. Theremin, you're going to pick her up. One turn until reinforcements arrive, so that's a little scary. Oh, I'm so annoyed at myself for not realizing that uh, Duck Nose could have just gone in for that takedown. I'm gonna move up to here. I trust this is Duck Nose, let's get you. Let's see, this Overwatch costs what? One movement, one fire. That'll only get us to where? Wow, not very far. I'd like to get over here and Overwatch down this area. I think I'd rather that, but we know there's people down there. God damn. So we know there's two of them over here. We know there's somebody in here. I could get a spotter on them. Just to see their movements. Um, Sure, let's see what's going on in here. Confirm that. Alright. Where are you? Where are you? And we can shoot either of these guys. Might as well finish them off here. Yep. Okay. Oh, through the through the floor, through the floor. Hi. Ah, uh, Thurman, you're fine. I'm gonna save the smoke screen for next. We better be able to jump off of here. We better be able to. Overwatch established. All right, I hear that. Someone's overwatching. Gotta be clever. We got reinforcements arriving. Uh, I can't. I'm, I'm never gonna. Ooh, this isn't good. I'm never gonna <laughs> be okay with the fact that I didn't realize that I could have just taken that agent down. But hey, you live and you learn. You live and you learn. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get a little bit of spotting going on in this general area. Just to see if there's more agents we can hit. Alright. Okay, good spot. So Duck knows you can get your grenade right in over here and hopefully... Excellent. You can kill all three of these, I hope. 60, 65, 55. So yes. It does end the turn. So what I might want to do instead is... move you. Oh, we can't actually get out here. Oh, 
Okay, how- why? Why can't I climb out this window like I've climbed out of every window in the past to get onto this to jump down? That's frustrating. That's frustrating. So we'll have to take these stairs down instead and then go out the door here and then walk all the way down here. Ugh. That's frustrating. All right, fair enough. Thing I can do about it. Let's at least get this frag grenade out here to make sure these guys are taken care of. All three of them. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Boom, down they all go. Good kills. And uh, yeah, I guess we rush out this way. Let's go, let's go. So slow. All right. All right. Wondering if I want a smoke screen anywhere. I could actually pop one in this area for when we pass through it, I think. Oh, in this area. Wish I'd left this door open. Man. Feeling a little misled. Now my evac's gonna be compromised. I could have made it. This is. I, I could have made this. There's no reason I can't climb onto this roof like I've done countless times before. This The windows aren't barred or anything. In fact, this window is straight up broken. Alright, alright. All right. Evac compromise. Yeah, I'm painfully aware. What up? Aramin, we're gonna get you over here. Duck nose, we're gonna get you over here. We got the Overwatch on the stairs. In case somebody decides to come up, hopefully they will. Alright. There we go. Oh, no. Alright, you're staying put. Are you gonna fire at Theremin from down there? You better not. God knows what else they have down there. What else? Who else? My frustration knows no bounds right now. Alright, so I could get how far down? I can just get up to like here. I could fire from up here. I could even fire. Maybe I could fire from up here, I think. Maybe take care of this guy. He's in full cover though. I don't know about my chances there. But it's one movement, so we might as well. Right? And then I could get into Overwatch. He didn't fire for some reason. So I could get into Overwatch. Theremin could put the enemy agent down and then fire this way. Or like move over here for that point blank shot. But I have my doubts about that working. There might be... Uh, we know there's like three agents or something down here. I'm a little nervous about that. He should be able to see us from where he is right now. So maybe we walk back instead draw them up so we can overwatch like I so theremin can fall back like so I'm actually tempted to have him you know what I think I will I'll have him put down the agent and he'll overwatch as well. Or maybe he should stabilize, jeez. And I'll just pick her up again next turn. So, okay, fine. Uh, let's get that... But I swapped that VZ-61 out. I'm crazy. I'm losing my mind. Let's overwatch with Gal. Alright, come on. Come on, come at me. Come up these stairs. Come up these stairs, damn it. Oh, there it is. Nice! <laughs> Give me another one, come on. Give me another one. No? Nobody else wants some? Alright, fair enough. Fair enough. God damn it. Still so annoyed. Duck Nose could have just taken her down. We wouldn't have to deal with this. It would be a completely smooth mission. 
Alright, Theremin. Let's pick her up. Gonna get Duck Nose moving down the stairs. Alright, let's see. Oh, it'll take two turns to get down. Fair enough. I guess I could put her over to here first, just to see what's going on down there, if we have any vision. And we do. And I could move up to here and pop this guy's face clean off, point-blank range. Push him to here instead, just so I have cover in what direction? No need. Taking a bit of a risk. Taking a bit of a risk. Let's do it. Yeah, because of this guy. I, I had a feeling. This girl, I should say, with a rifle, too. With a rifle, too. At least I can kill this guy. Yeah, let's uh, finish him off like so. I don't have a grenade or anything, so yes. Not this person. This person. Pistol B76. Confirm that. 67 damage. Alright. We've got this. We've got this. Theremin, you can get down to here and you can pop shots as well. Alright, can we get a smoke screen down in here? No, smoke screen only goes down to here. Which might be the exit path I want to take. Uh, I can get the smoke screen down over here as well, so that's good. At least on our way out, we'll be fine. If it's just this rifle that's shooting, Duck Nose will be fine, but she'll be hurt, which is frustrating. We can get Theremin up here instead. Well, instead. We'll get Theremin moving, there's no reason not to. Got the airstrike coming as well, but hopefully we'll be fine underneath that. Hmm. Am I missing anything? Am I missing anything? Smoke screen cannot cover me at all. No chance, no chance. It can only cover there. It can, for some reason, cover here, but not up here. Okay. Alright. Alright, it is what it is. Yep, that's the turn. We're gonna need some shots. There's an airstrike coming as well. It is what it is. Oh, I'll be <laughs> kicking myself right now so hard. Oh, he made a mistake. Oh, okay. Going into cover, obviously. Just grazed, just grazed. We're alright. Oh, no. Oh, you've just got a handgun. Okay. <laughs> I don't underestimate handguns, I guess. Alright, Duck Nose, come on now. Come on now. How many more of them could there be? In this hallway right now. A lot of them. God damn it. We, got, we were so close. Alright. So I can actually run out right now. Theremin, how far can you get? You can get up to this door, and then you can get through as well. Alright, so, Duck Nose. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to move on up to here. Okay, we're going to open this door up. See what the hell's going on. Looks like we're clear here. Theremin, how far can you get? You can get up to... Well, you can get up My to here-ish. Let's see where our smoke screen can get to. And cover this entire area. So, I say, Duck Nose. Oh, the first one. Smoke screen. Just trying to get my eyes on where we'll be fine. We should be fine over here. And Theremin. Can get right down to over here as well. Get even farther than I thought, actually. So here's what we'll do. We'll put Theremin over to here. Let's get that smoke screen in, please. All right. This will cover us both. And it'll give us some movement range. Yes, confirm that. 
very little movement range, but movement range nonetheless. All right, here comes the smoke. And let's also get some vision in here, if possible. Just see what the hell's going on. Because we might want to go through this door. We have access to it in cover. Let's get Overwatch looking down this way. In case anybody should come through. And let's end the turn here. Alright. We're okay, we're okay. A bit of a beating, but we're fine. We're making it through, and we're getting the agent. We'll be fine. Standing by it's like Overwatch, more like Oversight. Hey. Alright. Now, I could stay within the bounds of this smoke for now. Keep myself safe, not expose myself to these windows and all. Uh, I do want to get close enough, though, to get out next turn if possible because where, where can we oh I wish I could see where else I could oh, okay I should be able to pop it down over here that should cover us okay 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 so duck nose let's get you over to here you should still be safe let's get that overwatch looking down this way with that LMG could do it in a radius but not worth it get it looking down this way Right, and Theremin, uh, you're, I think you're fine where you are. Oh wow, you can actually get there right now. Interesting. Despite carrying somebody, you're, you're faster. Funny. Funny how that works. You hit nothing. You hit nothing. Alright. Using smoke a lot better this time than I did, uh, two times ago. You know what I'm not using? Take down. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna keep taking myself down about that. All right, I think the smoke dissipates now. Yes, it does indeed. We should be good to roll out though. Duck nose can get up to there. Theremin can get up to where? Also there. Of course. Why? Why? Why would we have enough range to get further? But if I pop the smoke screen over here. like so. Confirm that. Alright. In it comes. Boom. I, I, I do like that sound and animation. Alright, so we're good here. So Duck knows we could push you. I want to go through the window. Or I could stay tucked in over here. Now let's go, let's go through the window. Let's tuck up over here. Hopefully no one's on Overwatch. Oh, we're good. Hopefully nobody heard that. <laughs> Theremin, you're up over here again through the window. And let's get Duck Nose on Overwatch with that V76. Just looking in a radius. Really wiser looking up this way, actually. Now that I think about it. Let's do that. Alright. Alright. Okay. We're okay. We're fine. Everything's all right. It's good to get your blood pumping like this. You know? It's good. Oh, you're going to try and drop uh, a missile on me? I don't think so, buddy. All right, Duck Nose, let's get you into the evac zone. Theremin, into the evac zone. And just like that, in the smoke, like magicians, we disappear. No harm, no foul. Everyone's okay. Everyone's okay. Everyone is okay. All right. There we go. Mission success. Two agents out. We got ourselves an agent, agent as well. Evac compromised yet again. Shameful. We might need to actually find a new uh, hideout. Now, we tracked down Omicron to an enemy safe house and succeeded in breaking him out. Unfortunately, he only knows the place we're looking for by its code name, Cornerstone. As we've discovered. Our only chance is that the holder operatives are having the same problem we do. And if we can crack the file first, we might get the necessary head start. So again, this kind of hap comes in when I load into the game. I wish it was, I mean, anyway, this is, this is our current situation, as you guys are well aware of. All right, we got ourselves a Cobra. 
We got ourselves uh, an M10 serrated ammo, which is super cool. Uh, MU255, and we've captured Screw. Also, Capote, enemy revealed. Now, Capote, from my CIA episode that I did pre-release, is a CIA agent, or is it just a free agent? Nonetheless, it is an agent. Interesting to see that connection, though. Now, Ducknose is wounded. Damn, you know what I wanted to do? I wanted to use the med pack on her before we left the mission. Just another oversight there. Again, Overwatch, more like oversight. Nonetheless, lots of experience gained. That's good. How long will it take you, Duck Nose? How long till you're out? Well, Indigo's almost out, so that's cool. Indigo's almost ready to go. Um, one whole day. One whole day. I mean, I could always deploy her and pop that first aid kit, but that seems wasteful. No one got burned in that mission, which is nice to see. And what else is nice to see is we have Screw available here for interrogation, for brainwashing. We can really screw with her mind and uh, hopefully get something out of her. Get some more information, perhaps. I don't know. It'll take some time, but it'll be worth it. And back in the uh, world map, we still have this recon mission happening. It'll take nine hours to complete. And we have the uh, Beholder Cell in Dublin to take down. And that'll be an exciting start to our next session, because this is where we're going to call it a session. We definitely need to find a new hideout over here. As you can see, that enemy agent that's been captured increases our danger. It ticks it up, and eventually we're going to get into the red. Not this time, though. Thank you all, as always, for watching. I hope you had a good time, and if you did, please do not hesitate to let me know by dropping a like and a comment. As I said before, it makes a very big difference to how I approach content on the channel. A massive thanks as well to all of my patrons for supporting the channel on a month-to-month -month basis. If you'd like to become a patron as well, uh, I've got the Patreon link in the description down below. Even a dollar a month makes a massive difference, especially for uh, series that maybe you know, don't get as much viewership and stuff like that. Nonetheless, thank you all, most of all, for joining me in this journey. Till next time, das vidanya.